Put your mind at rest, Mr. Brown. The worst is over. There is nothing wrong with my mind. Oh. Does it hurt very much, Mr. Brown? I'm in mortal agony, and you ask, who are you? The superintendent. Where is my name? We got to you just as quick as we could, sir. The entire facilities of the hospital are at your disposal. The head surgeon is standing by. The best room... Oh, it's all very heartwarming. Tell me more when I bleed to death. Well, why do you stand there? Get Mr. Brown to his room. I'll take three appendectomies to one perforated ulcer any day. Mm, me too. You know, for a couple minutes there, we almost lost her. I can't keep polish on my nails to save my life. I know, it's terrible. Come on, off your seat. Let's clean up this place now. Don't rush me. I'm half dead. One dance and they'll cart me off the floor. Oh, my gosh, the dance. Oh, Flora, will you do the cleaning up? Margolis is having a sale. I saw a beautiful light blue chiffon, half price. I can't wear that old black thing again. Sure, go ahead. Oh, thanks, Flora. Wish I could afford a new dress. I can afford it. This is my annual splurge. Just a minute. We have an emergency. Katie, oh, I want you... Oh, it's past quitting time. Am I interrupting you? Look, we've had six today. We had a gallstone and also two after... Miss McDermott. But tonight's the nurse's dance. Uh, there's a dress on sale, half price. The store closes in half a This is a little more important. Get set up immediately. Dr. Bretherton will operate. Dr. Chadwick will assist. What a way to make a living. Work like a slave all day, and what thanks do you get? A sneer from old Bat Puss. Well, anyway, Jeff Chadwick will assist. The walking ice cube. You can have him. A magnificent cubby of quail. You don't see a flight like that but once a season. I had them dead in my sights when this maniac tripped. His stinking gun went off. And several pieces of buckshot lodged in your uh, very sensitive part of your anatomy. Right. Uh, we'll have them out before you know it. And Miss Vogel, the premedication. So he's got a little lead in his pants. Why, the medical convention. Don't you know this isn't A, Mr. Brown? This is the Mr. Brown. $100,000 a year, Mr. Brown? Why, the poor suffering lad. Well, what am I, a freak? Why don't you charge admission? Well, this is Dr. Chadwick, our resident surgeon. He'll assist in the operation. Don't worry about a thing. We're going to take the very best care of you we know how. Look, may I ask you a favor? Stop telling me what you're going to do. Do it! <coughs> oh, handle the care. I'm fragile. Why does Vogel pick on us? I wanted to get that dress so much. Well, it never fails. Annual dance, and we have to be hit by an emergency. Someday I'm going to tell old Batpuss just what I think of this job. That'll be the day. I'm about to be cut to pieces. If you angels of mercy don't care, at least shut up. Hey, get this. Well, some emergency. I'm shot, vitally wounded. Vitally? Do you know who I am? Oh, don't tell me. Let me guess. Uh, the Lone Ranger. Oh, what do I have to do to get any sympathy? Kill myself? It's an idea. What's going on here? You wanted some sympathy on fresh out. It's time you learned, Miss McDermott, that the operating room is no place for flippant talk or behavior. Least of all, at this moment. <clears throat> yes, Doctor. Are you ready, Miss McDermott? You know me, day and night, always available. Oh. I give $100,000 a year to this institution. That is too much to be treated like a criminal. She'll never treat another patient like that. I'll have her blacklisted, personally. We'll make amends. Anything you say. I say scratch me off your sucker list. I'll be looking for a way to save money. Mr. Brown, when your father established this endowment 10 years ago, he felt that it was a worthy cause. I disagree. Nevertheless, his wishes should be taken into account. If you want to consult with him, you may find him in Oakmont Cemetery. Look, you've been financing some valuable research projects. New ways to torture the patient? We can do without that one. I beg you to reconsider. Okay, I'll reconsider. No! Now out, everybody out, go on. 